fugitive from justice and you, the viewers, help these wanted suspects be apprehended. Last week, James, the brother and follower of Jesus, was captured, tried, convicted, and executed. All thanks to you and the tireless efforts of our brave law enforcement officials. This week, our show spotlights one of the ringleaders in the Jesus game, Simon, cryptically referred to in sedition circles as the Big Fisherman. Since the crucifixion and rumored revival of the Messiah figure Jesus, whom we have reported on in previous programs, Simon Peter had become an notorious figure in the news. Weeks earlier, when the Sadducees and the high priest had thrown Peter and the other followers of Jesus in the town jail, they had escaped under what we might call mysterious circumstances. The last week, Simon, who also goes by the alias of Peter, was finally named by the Roman authorities and placed in Herod's prison for trial and sentencing. But unbelievably, he somehow managed to escape the high security stronghold with the help of unknown accomplices and is currently at large healing the sick, causing commotions, and spreading his heretical and dangerous doctrines. Tonight, we dramatize the events of the day in jail break based on the testimony of eyewitnesses. Keep your eyes open for Jerusalem's Most Wanted. all the help you can get after that whole Messiah fiasco. Oh, we'll supply him with some choice companies, sir. Murderers, thieves, rebels, a religious zealot like this should feel right at home. Good. I'll be back in the morning. Watch out for any rest of <laughs> This is the same guy who walked out of the town prison the other night. With all the doors still locked. He's a slippery one. Oh, he won't escape from this prison, sir. We pledge our lives on that. Good. Because there'll be four fish and anything happen to let him escape. <laughs> Welcome to our humble land. I hope that you find your room to your liking. Anywhere the Lord Jesus places me is fine, as long as he's with me. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry to break with you, but I don't see Jesus anywhere. Of course not. He's dead. Oh, wasn't Jesus that crazy Nazarene guy they crucified not too long ago? They did, but he lives. Come on. Come on, we all know that you or one of your friends stole his body from the tomb while the guards were asleep. You mean Roman guards like you? If a gang of men crept past an entire squadron of soldiers, broke the seal, moved a huge stone, and walked off with the body without breaking a single guard, then getting out of here with a few of you should be a breeze. If you get out of here, we'll all be burned alive. I don't think we'll let that happen. As I recall, none of the guards around the tomb were killed or even disciplined. I wonder why I have to tell the truth. You know, he's got a point. None of those guards were even disciplined. And sleeping on duty is punishable by death. Doesn't make sense. Fools, don't let this ignorant fisherman put doubts in your mind. What are you, followers of this Jesus now? Well, how do you explain it? I mean, I saw some of those same guards spending money like there was no tomorrow. I mean, not only do they get lit, well, they get let off for sleeping on duty, but they get paid up. It smells like cover up to me. Keep it up, man. Keep it up. And you'll be chained up right next to this Simon guy. <laughs> Looks like they already are. <laughs> He's got another good point. <laughs> well, Simon. Peter. Jesus gave me new life. And a new name. <laughs> well, Simon, Peter, whatever your name is, weren't you a fisherman before you started following this Jesus guy? I was. Yeah, I remember you. You're my fire tonight in residence. That's that's right. And you did not even know anything. Three times by your call. I did, to my shame. So I don't get it. What makes you so dedicated to this guy now? Because he forgave me and restored me and commissioned me to be part of his great work, saving the souls of sinful men. He is God and my life is his. Okay, well if Jesus is God and he's so powerful, why is he letting you sit in this jail cell waiting to get your head chopped off? I think he's getting back at you. <laughs> I know, 
I know. I think that is denying knowing you during your arrest. Payback time. <laughs>